Hello there and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to talk about the trading post and more specifically we're going to take a look at everything that is available from the trading post in March 2023. Yes, a new month is here already and we have a bunch of brand new items available on the trading post. But before we jump into all the March offerings, I just want to shout out my Twitch, twitch.tv slash MrGM. If you want to see me stream World of Warcraft, Dragonflight, Wrath of King Classic and more, I'm over on twitch.tv slash MrGM every single day. Right, so a new month is here, which means a brand new bunch of items on the trading post. This is our first new month of items since the trading post has released. So this month's theme is called March Looking Good. And the special monthly reward for completing the Traveler's Log is the Ensemble Dark Moon Harlequin Bells. This is a great looking set. This was data mined, but the appearance of it was not data mined. This is a Dark Moon Fair themed ensemble set available for all armor types. Really, really cool. And that is a guaranteed bonus reward from completing the Traveler's Log in March. So with that being said, let's take a look at what is actually available to purchase from the trading post this month. So, not that. The first new item on the trading set this month is a plate ensemble. This is available for warriors, paladins, and death knights. This is a recolor of the paladin tier 17 set. So a really cool looking set, as you can see, as mentioned, uh, recolor of the paladin set, but it is only available for plate users, uh, warriors, paladins, and death knights. The next item is a new cloak back piece. The trusty treasure trove. This is one of the 3D back pieces. This is awesome. This is actually so, so cool. So it's a 3D back piece of a treasure chest. It's got a crown. It's got a, you know, it's got a necklace hanging out of it. It's really awesome, actually. I'm really impressed with that. And it is really nice to see brand new items being added to the trading post. The next new item is the Ensemble Glorious Dragon Riders Mail. So this is a mail set. This is available for Hunters, Shamans, and Evokers. Uh, this is a recolor of the Dragon Riders Island set. Uh, really, really like this set. Uh, a lot like I don't know what's going on with the chest I don't know if it's missing or, or what's going on there but nonetheless the shoulders look really great I actually really like the helm this is one of the nicer mail sets to be honest and there is really not that many nice mail sets but yeah as you can see the chest is kind of broken perhaps but uh, obviously you know EU being first maybe this is a bug maybe that'll be fixed uh, later on down the line but yeah it does look like that this set is uh yeah, pretty cool, pretty nice. And as mentioned, it is a recolor of an existing set, but it is a really nice recolor nonetheless. So the pet this month is the Pandaren Monk Pet. This originally was on the Battle.net store and has now made its way onto the Trader's Post. So if you never obtained the Pandaren Monk back in the day, it is now available on the Trading Post. The next item is Frozen Shadow. This is a one-handed sword, which is a recolor of Hailstorm. Love this recolor. Kind of uses the sort of same animation as one of the enchants, I think you got from one of the collector's editions uh, but nonetheless a really cool looking recolor of hailstorm that is available for 400 traders tender uh, the next item is a new model of a shield this is the Phil Greed Lions Moor. This is a really cool looking alliance themed uh, shield. This is available for Alliance and Horde, of course. This is a brand new appearance which has been added to the trading post and will be available at 250 traders tender. Uh, the next two items are new models as well. They are two handed swords. These are the Blade Masters swords. This is the triumphant Blade Masters great sword. So it's a little hard to see, but you can see it's kind of a basic sort of Blade Masters weapon here, uh, available for 225 each. Uh, but yeah, there's two variants of this. So you have the Triumphant Blade Masters great sword and the Shadowy Blade Masters great sword, uh, which is a kind of like darker and purple variant as opposed to the kind of lighter and red variant. But these are really cool looking, and as mentioned, they are actually brand new models as well. Uh, the next item is the Dread Admiral's Bicorn. This is for, available for 175 tender. This is a head transmog piece. Uh, I don't think it's a new model as such, but it is a cool looking pirate helm. As you can see, I do have the pirate set on from last month. So this would be a very nice addition to that at 175 traders tender. The next item is the Ensemble, the Vengabond's Midnight Threads. This is a black version of the Ensemble that we did get last month in pink, so this one is probably going to pop up a couple of times. There is some variants of this available in the game files, so there's going to be a couple of colors coming up each month, uh, and this month it is the black version. Uh, this obviously includes a helm and a cloak piece. The next item is the Ensemble Wanderer's Midnight Trappings. This is kind of a scarf piece which is a helm and a back piece so it's a very subtle looking thing I did show this off last month and thought it was bugged because I was doing it on a dwarf 
I took your advice with doing it on a human this time, so it definitely looks a lot better. And as mentioned, this was available last month in pink and it is now available in black. The next item is a offhand. It is the Gnomish Liquid Transfer Apparatus. Uh, cool looking kind of offhand bucket. Not really too much to say, it's only 75 tender, so if you want to walk around with a, a Gnomish bucket, then that is available for you on the trading post for 75 tender in March. The next item is the Fabulous Flashy Finery. This is a shirt transfer available for 50 traders tender. A cool looking shirt, I must say, uh, you know, if you are into RP and things like that, or if you just want to look pretty flashy with a purple waistcoat and a, a jacket, it would have been nice if it was 3D, but it is just a shirt transfer at the end of the day. If you want to purchase this, this is going to be available for 50 traders tender uh, during the month of March. And finally, the Great Cloak of the Virtuous Protector. So this is a uh, existing model in the game, but it is a larger, longer version of an existing model. So the original model for this is the Paladin Tier 19 Cloak. Uh, but as mentioned, this is a longer version, as you can see, go, kind of goes a bit lower down than the previous cloak. Uh, this is available for 50 Traders Tender. Uh, as mentioned, just a back piece if you want to collect that. That is going to be available during the month of March. So there you go, that is all of the offerings for the trading post in March. Really cool. We didn't have any preview or anything like that posted. So yeah, this has all been a really nice surprise to wake up to uh, here on March 1st. So yeah, there you go. March is looking good. I really like the uh, the Dark Moon set. I'm glad we're getting that already. That's really cool. Uh, so let me know down below what you think of this month's offerings. Are you going to be purchasing anything? Are you going to be freezing anything? Let me know down below. Uh, I really like this uh, trusty treasure trove back piece. It's probably one of my favorite pieces here. But So yeah, thank you very much for watching, guys. If you like this video, please do like and subscribe to the channel. Be very much appreciated. If you want to support me outside of YouTube, I have a Patreon and I am on Twitter at MrGMYT. I also have a Discord server as well. And as mentioned, I am streaming on Twitch.tv slash MrGM. If you want to see me streaming World of Warcraft, Dragonfly, Dragonfly PTR, Rathachin Classic, any sort of wow, Twitch.tv slash MrGM. And with that, guys, I'll see you next time.